I'm Al. Welcome to part two of Simple English Question Practice. There are 50 questions in this set. They are a little more difficult than the previous questions, but do your best. Okay, uh, you can either answer the question with a complete sentence, or you can just repeat the question for practice at asking questions. Okay, good luck. Number one, uh, what do you do when you are hungry? Number two, uh, when do you turn off the light? Number three, is Narita Airport in Tokyo Prefecture? Number four, was the iPod invented by Apple? Number five, uh, where do you go to buy over-the-counter medicine? Number six, have you been to Disney World in Florida? Number seven, uh, if you were rich, what would you do first? Number eight, uh, what languages had you learned uh, by the time you graduated from high school? Number nine, could you speak English when you graduated from high school? Number nine, I'm sorry, number ten. Uh, do you think that English is too difficult in some ways? Number 11. Uh, where in the station do you wait for a train? Number 13. Uh, what do you do while riding the train? Number 14. Uh, what would you do if you had unlimited money and one month of free time? Okay. Number 15. Who were the pyramids built by? Number 16. Is the left bank in Paris on the west or the east side of the Seine River? Number 17. Where did you live when you were 10 years old? Number 18. What did Noah build and how long did it take him? Number 19. Is Italy in the northern or southern hemisphere? Number 20. Australia, Canada, England, and the United States. Which one is the odd one out and why? Okay. Number 21. What are some products sold by Apple? Number 22. In what part of Europe is Sweden, and is it east or west of Norway? Number 23. Uh, where were the 1964 Olympics held? Number 24. What language besides English is used in Canada? Number 25. How many states comprise the United States? Number 26. Where is Los Angeles located? Number 27. What is Eddie Murphy's occupation? Number 28. What is the name of a book written by Mark Twain? Number 29. If there is a cup of coffee on the table in front of you, uh, what action must you do before you can drink it? Number 30. What is the opposite action of 
put down. Number 31. What do you do with a vacuum cleaner when you are finished using it? Mm -hmm. Number 32. What is a dictionary useful for? Number 33. How far can you go into a forest and what will you be doing after you pass that point? Number 34, what's the opposite of boring? Number 35, how much time does it take for you to go to your local station on foot? Number 36, how many countries had you visited by the time you were 20? Number 37. Alaska was purchased from Russia by the United States for $7.2 million. What did I say? Hmm. 38. What will you do if your friend asks to borrow a thousand yen? Number 39. Where was Arnold Schwarzenegger born, and what is his current occupation? Number 40. When are the trains in Tokyo the most crowded? Number 41. What is the most popular tourist destination for Japanese? Number 42. What is the website address of the Smiths School of English? Or Smiths A. Kaiwa. Number 43. About how many Smith schools are there in Japan? Number 44. Who owns each Smiths school? of English. Mm -hmm. Number 45. Do you have to pay for a large number of lessons in advance if you attend a Smith School of English? Number 46. Which teacher do you think cares more about whether his students really learn and continue studying, a Smith teacher or a teacher at one of the large corporate schools? Number 47. Which English conversation school in Japan do you think currently spends the most money on advertising? You might be right. Number 48. How can those large schools afford to spend so much money on advertising? That could be the case. Number 49. Have you checked out a Smith school yet? Number 50. What are you waiting for? Okay, see you next time. And uh, until then, hang loose and enjoy life. Bye for now.